Lines episode 7, and if you, and spoiler warning, skip this, if you don't want spoiler, there's a tsunami in episode 8. Um, we're following this bus driver guy. He's, um, doing his job, and we continue seeing that he's, uh, he just finished his, um, bus, first bus routine. Let me speed it up. He's stuck on the road, thinks he's good, then he sees a bunch of people on the dirt road. So he's on the dirt path now. He's on the dirt path. He thinks that is the road. Until it begins to deteriorate. Like. By like a lot. You know, the road deteriorates. Until he realizes the road has deteriorated. Uh oh, a head on collision. The I, how for the I 42, seemingly. Uh oh, is this a head on collision? Let's see how it plays out. They just crash through each other, meaning uh, the bus is too fat, and your motorbike is the true head of state. The bus the driver is tired. I mean, the car is literally no clip. He thinks this is a disaster in the making. Disaster waiting to happen. A lot of concrete houses. A few people get on the bus. Or 12. Probably industrial workers. He begins to drive home back. As you can see, we have cars. The industrial complex grows ever more hungry. For the workers. Anyway, we have to service our industrial demand because there's a bunch of it for no reason now. Again. Now you might be tired of servicing the industrial demand. You want to see the tsunami. Wait till episode 8 because I'm still trying to get this industrial complex even proper functioning. Because uh, I don't want... um. With the, I'm trying to make sure this, this um, industry doesn't get wiped out by the tsunami. In the episode, because I don't want a tsunami that kills literally all the industry capacity. It's supposed to cause a reason for me to have to wipe out like a lot of the stuff in the old town, in the new city. Like, there's new demand. Build, build, bigger, better, big, big, bigger. So what we're going to do is begin to expand the city. You know, a big company called the Walmart Corporation wants to move in. Also, we're going to go to industry um, oil. Or, so see this? So these are industry trucks. We're getting rid of the ore truck. So this blue variant should become green. So you have a yellow variation, blue vari a red variation, and of course the other ones. Red variation, a green variation, and of course, we're done. Now you might hear noises, um, shush. Oh, I forgot about the police. Someone's getting mugged right now, I mean robbed, their house is getting destroyed. I forgot about the police station, so we'll build one right now. So what will only- oh, the- how did the demand for the, um, commercial go away? There was still demand. It shouldn't go away, just go away like that. Okay, I think I'll build the grid real quick. And I just did it. 
I'll just build this out. So let's plan this. These are my planning roads, so what I'm planning to build. This is what the city's planning to build in the future. Of course, it will be canceled due to the tsunami, but um, who cares? Might as well plan. Might as well make the city plan. Anyway, I don't want parking here, because if you add trees, there won't be parking, so. Yeah, it's a neighborhood where you have to. If you live on this um echelon where it's like a jetted peninsula, um, we're going to have a path so you don't have to drive and to leave. It's going to have a path. Right here. And now we have residential and big zone. 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 Commercial. This game is fun. Except that when your game isn't working because you accidentally downloaded mods that don't like working together. And as we continue to build the city, we have this zone and we'll save the game. What I hate about cloud saves is that if there's no internet, I um, well, I can't record since I. I'm using a web recorder called Vimo. I don't have one pre-installed inside of my computer because I don't know anyone that's anyone any that's free. Anyway, I'm gonna go check the pollution levels that are made by that sewage pump alone because I'm worried that uh the industry isn't pumping enough. It's supposed to be like um um a heat a, mer a maritime disaster, but it doesn't seem like it's pumping anything into the river it seems like that where's that sewage one there's the sewage one and anyway, the industry is ordered to delete it because how much the ground was polluted so they have to use the sewage pump since the federal laws is kind of already broken and lobbying pretty does a good you call this industry what's this i asked for ore industry not this what's that Cubes and it's the industry town is quiet place as its sewage is being dumped into the river, which is dangerous and dumb. Luckily nobody nobody lives oh. Also we have a angsty gang, angsty kid. So all people are going home to the night for the night. Some of your trees look dead though. You might want to fix those. It's a small, small community. But then, um, there's a building on fire. Okay, I forgot to fix those burnt buildings. And anyway, there was an industry demand that people wanted filled. A very small one though. So people want to build an industry that isn't ore, except that they don't know what ore zoning is. So they want to just put everything as industry. Industry right beside Amsterdam Heights. Luckily, Amsterdam Heights is big enough that I can lobby. Boom, big town. Density. Now time for the tsunami episode. Anyway, we're ending the episode here. Bye.